Yeah, well, I think the, the biggest thing here is to acknowledge that that barrier does exist, right? We, it, it, that's the reality of it. We, it's a barrier that we're trying to break down actively in my generation, the next generation to come. We're actively working to break down the the barriers for women, the barriers for, for other areas of diversity where there may be some blockage based on history. I think what we need to do as people, taking, taking education, taking professionalism out of it as people, is just realizing that we all have the, the equal aptitude. We all have equal opportunity, not necessarily in dollars, not necessarily in status, but opportunity to, to, to think about and make a difference in something that matters. So whether, of course, you may be restrained from a monetary perspective, and you may not be able to get student loans, or you may not be able to have parents that pay for your tuition, but if you were to be given that opportunity, what could you do? Right. So I think telling that story and maybe even exposing um, success stories for people that were underprivileged, underserved and were competent enough to say, I'm going to take this opportunity by the handles, even though I know I have 100 things working against me, I'm going to use them to my advantage. I'm going to make them be something that is advantageous to my story and make me be different. And I think that's that's where, as, and we've seen it th throughout history, that's where everyone that has challenged the status quo has made strides in breaking down those barriers. So um, I hate to go into the conversation, you know, acknowledging something negative, but I do think it's a it's the reality that we all have to face. And um, it, uh, these are all learnings that we've all learned in school. And this is something that we have to to work on. And in order to, to get there, I think the supportiveness from an educational Per, sort of foundation certainly helps in having programs like the DeVry Scholarship Fund um, absolutely helps in making those strides and making education more attainable. So if we can help and be partners to people that have that interest um, and help them break down the barriers, then I don't see why this wouldn't be a successful venture.